Let's examine this reaction with regards to a very important principle, the Le Chatelier principle. You have an equation here, A plus B, giving rise to C, a product and heat, an exothermic reaction. We already know that the products are favored, the heat and the C, by the direction of the arrow. According to the principle, a system in dynamic equilibrium will always shift based on some sort of disturbance that it experiences. The disturbance can be in a variety of forms. This equation will shift towards the direction of the products and the heat by the following reasons. You can have an increase in the concentration of the reactants, A or B. You can have a decrease in the concentration of the products, C, that is the product is removed as it is made. You can also have an increase in the pressure which will shift it towards the right because the reaction will shift towards the direction of fewer moles. For an exothermic reaction as heat is given off, decreasing the temperature of the system will shift the direction towards the products. It would be a reverse effect for an endothermic reaction.